Hello everyone. Today we discuss Bernoulli's principal application on a problem is as follows. A 6 meter long pipe is inclined at an angle of 20 degrees with the horizontal. The smaller section of the pipe which is at a lower level is of 100 millimeter diameter and the larger section of the pipe is of 300 millimeter diameter as shown in the figure below. If the pipe is uniformly tapering and velocity of water at smaller section is 1.8 meters per second, determine the difference of pressures between the two sections. The diagram is given as below. Now to solve this problem, we are going to consider conditions at section 1 and section 2. So at 1, P1 is not given, V1 is 1.8 meters per second, then again A1 is given, it is from pi over 4 d squared which is equal to pi over 4 times 0 0.1 squared and the answer is 0 0.00 Seven eight five square meters. That is that is a one. Then at section two, at two, at two. Let us bring it here at two. Velocity V two is not given. Pressure P two is not known. But area A two is equal to pi d2 squared over 4 and this is equal to pi over 4 times d2 which is 0 0.3 squared this gives us 0 0.0707 square meter So the question says determine the difference of pressures between the two sections. So having determined the area A1, A2 and the listed the information as given, apply Bernoulli's principle. Apply and raise principle between one and two. Applying Banuri's principle between one and two gives P one over specific weight of the fluid plus Z one plus v1 squared over 2g equal to p2 over w plus z2 plus v2 squared over 2g. Now 
now assuming no friction losses Z1 obeying the starting point uh, because the datum passes through Z1 it is equal to 0 meters then Z2 is equal to Z1 plus the length of the pipe sine angle at which the pipe is inclined meaning Z2 will equal to 0 plus 6 sine 20 degrees and this is equal to 2.052 meters now substituting this information P1 minus P2 out of specific weight of the fluid plus Z1 minus Z2 is equal to a half over G into V2 squared minus V1 squared. Substituting the information that we have, the pressure difference is P1 minus P2 divided by the specific weight of the fluid plus 0 minus 2.052 equals 1 over 2g into v2 squared minus 1.8 squared because v1 is 1.8 squared now let us call this one equation 1 let's call it equation 2 for continuity equation a1 v1 is equal to a2 v2 meaning that v2 is therefore equal to a1 v1 over a2 which is equal to 0 0.00785 out of 0 0.00 seven zero seven times v1 this gives us zero point two meters per second therefore from minus p2 out of specific weight is equal to two point zero five two plus a half over g into 0 0.2 squared minus 1.8 squared the pressure difference p1 minus p2 out of specific weight equal to 2.052 plus 1 out of 19.62 because g in here it gives 1 out of 19.62 gives negative 3.2 p1 minus p2 will equal to 1.889 times w our the specific weight and since the fluid is water a specific weight of water is 9.81 uh, kilo newton per cubic meter will therefore equal to 1.889 times 9.81 which gives us give, gives us 18.53 kilo pascals